What if there were limitations on how fast you could drive your vehicle? Well, this is the concept behind a recent bill introduced in the California Senate, aiming to mandate the installation of speed governors in vehicles sold within the state. Senator Scott Weiner, representing San Francisco and a member of the Democratic Party, has put forth this proposal as part of a comprehensive set of bills designed to mitigate traffic injuries and fatalities within the Golden State. Quote, There's no reason why people should routinely be allowed to drive more than 10 miles per hour above the speed limit, Weiner said in an interview with the Los Angeles Times. Quote, You can want whatever you want, but that doesn't mean you're allowed to do it, and that doesn't mean you should be physically able to do it, he said. Senate Bill 961, the proposed measure, aims to mandate the inclusion of speed governors in all passenger vehicles, trucks, and buses manufactured or sold in California commencing from 2027. These devices, leveraging GPS technology or cameras, would validate the speed limit within a specific area and intervene to decelerate a vehicle exceeding the limit by 10 miles per hour. Senator Weiner has expressed willingness to consider adjustments to the bill, including the choice between active or passive speed governors, the LA Times has reported. Active speed governors would actively reduce the speed of vehicles surpassing the 10 mile per hour limit, while passive ones would emit a sound or a buzz as a warning for drivers to decrease their own speed. It's worth noting that the European Union has already enacted legislation requiring the implementation of passive speed governors in all cars sold in member countries effective from July.